Sophie, Duchess of Edinburgh, exclaimed that this is strangling me as she got out of the car for King Charles and Queen Camilla's coronation, a lip reader has revealed. It is not certain what Sophie was referring to as being the thing that was strangling her. Get the latest royal news straight to your phone by joining our WhatsApp community. But the lip reader has picked up that her words came during a conversation between her, Eugenie and Princess Anne. The lip reader says that Anne said, look at this, page 8, as if she was looking at the order of service for her brother King Charles III's coronation. Sophie said, this is strangling me, and Anne asked, I'm not sure, are they going to talk about? She may have been referring to her elegant white dress and ceremonial robes, which she has teamed with a floral headband. Sophie, and her husband Prince Edward, were part of the King's procession which travelled to Westminster Abbey from Buckingham Palace ahead of King Charles III and Queen Camilla. After the service, the newly crowned King and Queen will be joined by other members of the royal family, including Sophie and Prince Edward, to return to the palace, known as the Coronation Procession. Once they arrive back at Buckingham Palace King Charles and Queen Camilla, as well as other working royals, will appear on the palace's balcony. Last night, Sophie and her two children, Lady Louis and James, Viscount Severn, attended a pre-coronation dinner at Oswald's Private Members Club in Mayfair with other members of the royal family. The coronation service for King Charles and Queen Camilla started slightly later than scheduled, after a lengthy carriage procession took them from Buckingham Palace to Westminster Abbey. Following their arrival, the royal couple walked to the nave, smiling at some of the 2,200 guests in attendance. Both the king and queen walked followed by their pages of honor, who included Prince George and some of Camilla's grandchildren. The Prince and Princess of Wales, who were joined by Prince Louis and Princess Charlotte, walked into Westminster Abbey with their majesties as part of the procession. Royal fans were delighted as they spotted Prince Louis and Princess Charlotte holding hands while on their way to their seats. During the service, Charlotte was also spotted speaking to her younger brother, possibly to keep an eye on him and to tell him not to be too cheeky. Don't miss! Corey's Tony Maudsley brutally mocks Duchess Sophie at coronation, analysis, Americans slam coronation as abomination as they back team Meghan, report, Queen Rania of Jordan wears pretty pastel yellow dress at coronation, pictured, unlike Sophie and her husband Prince Edward, his brother Prince Andrew was relegated to having to sit in the third row for the coronation. This decision to seat him away from other members of the royal family would have been unthinkable a few years ago. But now, in case there had been any doubt for the millions of people watching the coronation across the globe, his position in the Abbey shows just how far his fall from grace has been. Despite this, he has been allowed to wear the traditional dress of a royal knight of the garter. Members of the Order of the Garter receive a velvet mantle, hat, collar and garter, among other vestments and accoutrements to wear on official occasions, 